powerful. See, and then, see, I'm from New Mexico, so of course this one's going to hit home a little bit. Former UNM Lobo. From here. Man, doing great things. See, this state, it seems kind of small. People probably don't even know us, and that's why I feel like it's an even bigger deal. What's up, everybody? So, you already know I love to go on Google Trends, see what's trending. So, the topic is former Lobo Rachel um, Balkovec makes history as first female minor league manager. Rachel, who played at UNM from 2007 to 2008, became the first female manager in affiliated professional baseball history after the Tampa Tarpoons hired her as the manager on Monday. The, ta the, tarpo and the tarpons or tarp tarpons are a low A affiliate of the New York Yankees. Balkovec, who was a catcher at New Mexico, previously made history when she was hired by the Yankees as a minor league hitting coach prior to the 2019 season. She coached in the Florida Complex League and last season was selected to coach in the 2021 MLB Future Games, which was also trailblazing achievement. Her experience with MLB started in 2012, starting out as a strength and conditioning coach with the St. Louis Cardinals minor league team and then moved on to work in the same role with the and Houston Astros minor league team. In addition, she has worked with the double A Corpus Christi Hooks as a skill acquisition coach with the Dutch national team and coach in the Australian Baseball League. See, now that's powerful. That's powerful. That's, that's amazing. Go, Rachel. You're doing your thing. But see, the reason why this is important, the reason why I wanted to talk about this is it's great seeing women come into these positions and coming into these um, careers and these opportunities and doing something that no one, no other woman has done yet, right? Getting into these fields that were probably dominated by men, but now you see these women being able to get into these positions and do amazing things, right? See, now that's beautiful and that's powerful. See, and then, see, I'm from New Mexico, so of course this one's going to hit home a little bit. Former UNM Lobo. From here. Man, doing great things. See, this state, it seems kind of small. People probably don't even know us, and that's why I feel like it's an even bigger deal. Because she's a woman now in this career. She's from, uh, she, former UNM Lobo. A place where probably people don't even pay attention. They don't even know who we are, what we do. That's powerful. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. See, what she is doing here, what she is out here doing and making moves and putting in the work, you're, you're seeing it, you know, yeah, in the front, forward. The battle lines. She's doing her thing. You see her accomplishing everything that she can and still doing more and making these moves and making headlines and doing something that no one else has done yet. Achievements even before this. So if this is inspiring to anybody, male, female, keep working, keep grinding, you will get there. You will break down barriers, you will break through doors, you will be put in positions that you probably thought you would never be in because of whatever set standards or whatever things may have been in place before. But now, you're in that position. Now you're making some moves. Now you're making headlines. Now all eyes are on you. See, just wanted to say that. Just wanted to talk about that a little bit because salute to a UNM Lobo. Salute to the women out there getting into positions that nobody ever thought they would be able to get in. And this is motivation. Stay moving. Stay grinding. Stay doing what you need to do because eventually you're going to get there too.
If you made it to the end of this video, I appreciate you so much, more than you ever know. So, Crayon Rocket, our motto is be unique, be creative, be you. Why is this important? Because we were all created in the image of God. We were all perfectly and wonderfully made. So, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Share it, like it, subscribe. I would appreciate it. God bless.